What's going on ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another solo leveling arise video. Alright guys, we're at 6,000 killed hard mode, keep pushing that shit, let's get it done. Go, uh, listen, I want to be part of that 7k, but I just can't get Kaisel down fast enough on my free to play. Almost there, but just not quite enough. So we're going to talk about what is out now, what you guys can expect, and of course the brand new points event that I want to go over because this is going to be a big one for you guys to get yourself a free SSR ticket. Now, the loyalty event right now is this. Obtain rings and earrings. All right, guys, this is an important one. So let me show you guys where to find that. Do this right and don't mess up. Okay, rings and earrings. So if you were like me and you actually did save up, this is an easy one. This is going to be our dude over here, the giant. Uh, we're going to go ahead and jump in, do four of these, and I'll show you guys exactly what you guys will get when you do this correctly. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and add min. There's min in there. Uh, you know what? Actually, let's yeah, leave it on there. We'll do this. We'll do the spear. Where's our spear? There it is right there. And we're going to just run right through this super, super fast. Okay. The, the two best skills here to use are going to be electric shock dagger toss. And if you guys have it, uh, will either be the, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? The raid one over here, if you don't care about breaking, you can just do Sonic Stream Raid. Or if you do want to break, you guys can do this one over here, which is actually really, really strong for, for, us, for us well too. Now, this is the setup for blessings. Here's my, my gear. Okay, this is my squad. So we're going to jump in here and get this done super fast. We're going to do this exactly uh, up to, I think it requires 17 keys to complete. And this should completely finish up what you need for this loyalty event. And then you can move on and wait for the last one that's coming out to get your secondary SSR weapon. Now, a couple of things I want to also discuss real quick. In the mail, we should be getting ourselves a few different prizes as well. Some custom free tickets, some rate up tickets. Make sure you are saving those for Thomas. Many of you guys have been asking, hey Payne, uh, should I go for Isla or Thomas? Are you guys out of your minds? You should 1,000% be saving for Thomas. Uh, if you are <laughs> debating otherwise, I don't know what you're thinking, but uh, I would imagine that you either have a really good strong dark team and you want to complete it, or or you are looking to bypass Thomas because you're not a fan, right? Uh, and if that's the case, shame on you. You should be a fan because dude looks freaking psychotically good. Uh, so I hope everybody has an opportunity to get him. Uh, remember, we're going to do a summon video with my entire members. Uh, it's going to be massive, so make sure you are there for it. And don't miss out on that, guys. Don't skip out on that. That's going to be a big one for everyone to be a part of. Uh, you guys should definitely watch that when it is out. Uh, and you guys are going to love it. I promise you. It's going to be one of the wildest times in SLA summoning history. And we're going to hopefully do this again in the near future with other members, uh, new upcoming members. So remember, if you are not a member of the YouTube channel, go and join and be part of the massive growing community of a thousand plus members. Uh, and guys, it's going to be huge. All right, let's, keep, let's go through this quickly. I'm trying to get this done so I can show you guys how, how, how to complete it. We're just going to break him super quick. Again, you don't need to break this boss, by the way. Like, he's super easy without a break even. Let him do this part here. Get Minin out. We're gonna break. We're gonna try to break him right now. Try to get Gunhee to break him. If not, then that's fine. We'll do one more. One more skill, which should actually eventually break him. He's gonna go downwards this time. One, two, three, four. Remember, he goes enraging soon, so don't cast anything when he enrages. You don't want to waste that skill. There we go. Nice break. Get our full moon in. Get Min out. And then cast our ult. Okay, so remember, 17 keys should completely finish up the entire event. About 17. That's why I say save, save 20 just to be safe. Uh, but in this case, we should be we should have more than enough to get this done. I hate this skill. Always when I don't have a dash. This is why I use Wu for everything nowadays. Wu's like my go-to support now for for extra dashes. Right, let's finish this off. Now, normally I dash here because I do have Wu to get more damage through, but we don't really have the luxury at the moment to do so. Come in here. Okay, he's almost dead. I could probably get tier. I could probably finish twenty on this one at this point. I should probably try something for a later date, obviously. Let's get this going. He's going to go into his little routine here that he likes to do. Not move right there. It's annoying as hell. Okay, here we go. Time to finish it up. Maybe not. Maybe 20 is actually might be a little too high for CP. There we go. Okay. So now you'll see once, once we get the points here, it's going to go through. Now, the question for a lot of you guys is going to be pain. What do we, what do we get? Right? What's, what, what, what should we aim for 
when we're going for this. Um, my suggestion personally is going to be just boost your massive, your DPS to the highest possible point. So for me, it's gonna be Mirai. So Mirai is my main DPS. You guys will see now if I look here, I'm gonna go to the dungeon. All right here's a draw point event. I got these accessories. You guys can see I got 85 points, 255 points, sorry. And that pushed me over to the free weapon. Now I should be able to get enough to push all the way to this one, I hope, by this event. And that will allow me to go ahead and choose my free selector which right over here is going to be Mirai. Okay, so it's remember, it's wind and dark, just so you guys are aware. I'm going to keep push, pushing Mirai till I get her to A10. Okay, so this is my Mirai now. Going to get pushed even further. And now you guys can see there is the boost to this one. Okay, we're going to go ahead and increase it. Select one more and it's A10. Okay, as a free-to-play player, not damn bad, man. Not bad to get yourself an A10 weapon as a free-to-play player. It's a pretty big deal, guys. Uh, so make sure you are, again, pushing your best DPS as the main focus, all right? Now, again, if you do look in the mail, you should see this right here, uh, right here. 20 tickets, 20 tickets, plus a lot of you guys are going to be asking, hey, Payne, what, another 30 tickets here, plus what is the best selector to go with? So let's go over that as well. This is going to be a very, very important one for everyone to kind of decide on. Uh, so I want to I want to help you guys choose the best possible selector for this event okay this is a big 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 deal all right so selector we're going to focus on the main ones that are going to make the biggest impact for you in the game okay so let's go over some of these reawakening huge 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 one this one is going to be one of the best ones you can possibly get 20 percent decrease in cooldown but it's not the main one the one i would probably get over anything else on this actual list to be honest with you guys this is i'm being completely real is bloodlust Bloodlust, I think, is going to be the biggest different maker in this game for you as a player because it reduces the target's defense by 12% for 6 seconds and can always be applied. If you take a look at the current ones that exist in SJWs, if you compare it to Bloodlust, like the heroic version, it's like night and day difference, right? It's 7% versus 12%. So this is the number one to go to go with. There's, there's no better choice. Another really good one is going to be Perception. Perception will increase your crit rate by 3% up to six times. So this is a massive one, especially when you're dealing with being under crit or being in the red. Um, so make sure that's one you focus on as well too. And then two other really big ones that I would really consider here is going to be Pulverize and Reawakening. Those ones are, are two of the bi biggest ones here. But quite honestly, I don't think anything will give you a better bang for your buck than going with actual Bloodlust. So for me, it's a no-brainer. I'm going to go with Bloodlust. This is going to push my damage even further. And I think this is one that everybody should consider as their number one go-to because it is for sure, in my opinion, the biggest difference maker in the game when it comes down to actual DPS content. Um, if you don't even have Bloodlust, welcome to doing a lot more damage per second quite often. Okay, so you guys can see here, this now provided me the legendary Bloodlust here. So I'm set for that. Uh, I also have Perception, which I now just got recently as well. So I can technically replace Pulverize with this if I need to. Uh, so that will push my SJW even further. And then I have myself this one here if I want to push even more. And this will give me my power at 254 now for free to play. I think I'm almost at the next battle tier. Almost there. Almost there. Okay, so Bloodlust, guys, I think is a no-brainer. I think that should be on everyone's list. And I think everybody should be using that one as their number one go-to source of legendary, um, their legendary blessing stone. It, to me, it's almost a no-brainer. Now, with that being said, let's go ahead and do a quick couple summons. Uh, we're going to go ahead and jump into this and make sure we we hopefully get gun heat. I'm trying to push my gun heat to A5 before Thomas comes out or during the time Thomas is released, at least. I want to I want to be able to get an A5 gun heat to push the amount of light damage I do plus crit damage that he does as well, too, obviously, for the entire team. So I think this is going to be a big, big deal if you can get yourself gun heat up to A5. So let me just get a few of these things out of the way and let's go ahead and tr jump in and pick the best possible <sighs> best possible draws we can get all right so 67 tickets 36,000. i think we're pretty secure for getting ourselves at least a one or two thomases i hope i i hope right this here now it comes down to one thing and one thing only i just want to get gun heat he has been eluding me since his, his limited banner my deepest regrets here guys has, has been not getting him uh, when, when his limited banner was out and I'm maxing, maxing him out, which was a big, big regret on my end. So very, very annoyed with that, but we're going to go ahead and do this and hopefully we can pull gun he out of here. Actually, I gotta take, I gotta take Charlotte. Oh shit. I was going to say, I gotta take Charlotte. Oh good. I got Harper. Woo. I was going to say, I need to get Charlotte off my list. I don't want her to be a, I'm going to put Mirai back in. I think having Mirai at 810 is a, is a genius idea. So I'm going to put her right here and I'm going to hope that I can 
I can pull more copies of her, and I'm going to take Charlotte out. I'm going to put Gunny in. Let's see, sorry, Miri stays. She goes out. Gunny go, goes there. Okay, so we got a copy of Harper. That's my first copy. Not not what I was expecting, not who I was hoping. Uh, I was really, really hoping that I would have got Gunny there. So that's a big, that's a kind of a fail, but also not really, because I do want to build Harper up just in case I need a good Dark Breaker, because I don't really have, I have Lim at A1, but we all know he's he's nothing compared to her. Come on, baby, please, 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 please. Okay, 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 okay. Nope. Fuckers. Please just, just, let me, let me just, come on, please. Please, just fake out for me. Oh, bro, really? Why you do me so dirty like that? All right, guys, we're going to do one more thing. Hold on. I have one more, I have enough, enough for one more summon, and I know I can get it right here. Oh no, they're giving me more of these now? Oh no, I can't. I can't risk it. I'm gonna just have to do this. We're gonna have to do that. I need those more. Those are way more important right now. Hold on. There's, a, there's. I think there's a new battle pass, right? Is there a new one? Oh no, they're both maxed out. Shit, I thought maybe we had a new one by now. I guess not. Shoot. Okay, well that's not good. God, guys, I want to just—I just want to copy Gun here. I wish they give us another character selector, and if it was a light one, we would have been set. Okay, we got—we got her. All right, all right. It is what it is. I'm gonna go farm and do some story mode. I, I might be able to get one more ticket out of this, and hopefully, actually, you know what? I know a way to get a ticket. I just realized. I just realized. I know how to get a ticket. Hold on, guys. Wait one second. I got this. I forgot. I forgot I could do this. Yeah, buddy. Let's push. Ah, fuck it. We're gonna go all the way in. Okay, let's go ahead and get our bonds. Forgot I could do that. There it is. Two tickets. Alright, alright. Let's see what we get this time. Here you go, guys. Who knows? Who knows? Maybe luck will be on my side. Come on, baby. Please. Please, 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 please. Just fake out or something. Never encouraging when you see that screen. Fuck. Well, there you guys have it. No gun he he eludes me yet again. Save all your damn weapon tickets as well for the new weapon when it comes out. Put DKD and this in there, and you guys should be balling. Alright guys, the pain. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.